tough. <laughs> now this next blow will end it. Leave it to your dad and his friends. Now you've really done it. You'll pay. So the sinners have arrived. Sinners? You're one to talk. You're one to talk after sending the ninja world into chaos. <laughs> you have no idea just how big a sin you've committed. What do you mean? Our group's name is Zero. Because it is our mission to take the ninja world and reduce it to zero. And for what reason do we wish to reduce it to zero? when the world is in the midst of peace and prosperity. It's because this current world you've created is wrong. It must be corrected. Hm. Sounds just like someone plotting a takeover. You are familiar with the underside of society. I expect you are well acquainted with the rampant spread of evil. But Zero is different. Everyone sought me out to change the world. While I may have been the one to form this organization, we are made up of people who willingly joined the cause. They volunteered to help and fully endorse my beliefs. What are you saying? I guess I should start with the end. You see, the world simply craves conflict. Living within a world of peace, a world of order, that may be satisfactory to you. However, peace eliminates conflict, and order defeats the entire purpose of ninja. This new age you created through the fourth great ninja war has created a rift of non-conflict behind the scenes. When the world doesn't seek conflict, where are the ones suffering in this rift supposed to go? They came to Zero, looking for the place they belong. Those who can only express themselves through fighting. Those who wish to test their strength. Mercenaries. Among them are some who lost their family in past conflicts and are looking for a way to release their anger. They seek conflict. They wish for a world where they can hurt, draw blood, and vent their emotions. They are seeking the reign of power Pain strived for. No way! Pain. Nagato, what he wanted was the peace that would come after. The methods you use. They're just encouraging conflict for no rhyme or reason. And what is the issue with that? History is cyclical. War ends, peace comes, and then we return to war. That is the way things are. Also, while I support Payne's beliefs, I don't wish to do everything he envisioned the same way. I am myself. I'll design my own era, one based on his ideology. In short, I'll destroy the current ninja world, and I will reinstate a time of war. Once that is accomplished, I'll become a god that surpasses pain! How foolish. Is that all you wish for? Your plan demands too much! Too many sacrifices, on your side and ours! Face it, you'll only spread misery throughout the ninja world! Great aspirations come with great sacrifices. The members of Zero are well aware of this fact. 
even Namashi. She agreed to use her abilities to support the organization in order to destroy the ninja world. Nanashi doesn't want that anymore. <laughs> yes. She lost the will to fight thanks to someone putting ideas in her head. She can't even be controlled anymore. She is nothing but a nuisance now. However, she can still be of use to me. Boruto Uzumaki, you said before that you wanted to take her with you. You can have her. I've already used her up. Nanashi! Who are you? Naruto! Guard is down. He's faster than I thought. Impressive reactions, Naruto. However, you are too naive. Got to fall. We can't let you get away with this. Heretic. I'll end you here. <laughs> What an honor it is to be fighting the strongest ninja of the present age. Try some of this! Let's do it! Already! Try some of this! Let's go! Let's do it! Let's do it! Looking at you fills me with so many emotions. What do you mean? I'm not a star. I'm not a star. I'm not a star. I'm not a star. I'm not I did not despair. That was because I was drawn to Kane's ideologies, and we managed to launch a revolution. However, you defeated Kane. Hidden Rain decided to go down a path based on the bombs. I was left behind, a relic of the past, and disappeared from the main stage, along with Kane's ideologies. Naruto was lucky. Let's go! Let me! Pain wouldn't have had to die. I wouldn't have had to create zero either. Your existence has, to my annoyance, greatly influenced my life. Well, corner him like this! I should say, I'm impressed. I can't believe you thought you'd win with skills like that. Don't underestimate us. Sasuke and I are powerful. <laughs> Victory is at hand. I was correct to lure you in here. What are you talking about? Ordinarily. I'm sure that my power would be no match for you, but in this case... Right now, unfortunately for you, you're already exhausted from all your previous fighting, so you have little energy left now. The simple fact is that you failed to best me. That's why you think you can win now? You slipped up. You see, you can exhaust us all you want. But even so, in the end... We're the ones who are going to win this fight! <laughs> Do you know the Yachihoko ability? The ability allows one to freely control the chakra of the person who is linked and return it to the user without limit. The Uchiha clan used this ability to try to enhance every visual jutsu they could. They failed, 
but the emergence of Yachihoko shook the world. That's Nanashi Uchiha's ability. Yes. Nanashi's ability. A skill that only she has. One that only she can use through her Sharingan. But then, there came a day. I learned something. Something very important. A newly developed artificial eye. The higher-ups didn't approve. But it would return my sight to me, and grant me great power as well, so... <laughs> Wait, you gave him those artificial eyes, Tegusei? Yes, I did! I gave them to Lord Mertz. I was able to get very good data as a result. Securing a supply of the chakra was difficult, but I found a way to resolve the issue. Be careful! The artificial eye Tegusei created is able to copy visual jutsu! Copy? Wait a sec. You mean... Exactly! It imparts a wondrous ability to its user. It allows them to use visual jutsu that had previously been limited to clan bloodlines! You see... I have created the ultimate artificial eyes! These are without a doubt my masterpiece! The fact that he has them means... <laughs> yes. I have Yachihoko! Naruto! Yes. <laughs> I can tell you see how dangerous these eyes are. Although, I'm afraid you're too late. <laughs> Countless ninja are already linked together, joined by the engraved Tsukuyomi. Are you aware of what that means? I'm sure you are. Their chakras are in my hands and I am able to freely draw forth from them as I please. The vast amount of chakra is able to fully unleash the Mangekyo Sharingan and be able to recreate that power! What is this? Come on! Since it's a copy, there are some visual differences. But even so, it should be more than enough to defeat you. You are no longer the most powerful ninja. to me. You are nothing more than that. <clears throat> I admit that you're tough, but still. It's over. Is that the best you can do? I'm sure your chakra reserves are empty by now. So just give it up and stop stalling already. This is the last moment of the two great ninja who made history? How pathetic. This is bad! Focus! Ha 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 ha! 
This is the way your era will come to an end! But my era is about to begin! Now die! But you... You were already... Nanashi. Just hold on. I'll put an end to this. You insolent little... Thanks, Orito. Step aside now. This battle isn't something for mere children to interfere with. You went too far. Dad and his friends had to overcome a lot to create this world for us. I can't let you mess it all up. But what I really can't forgive you for is how you just used Nanashi after everything she's been through and never once saw her as a human being. You fool. Nanashi is a weapon. What could be wrong with using a weapon? No, none as she is my friend. There's just no way that I could ever forgive you. For everything you've done to her. How could I be sweating? He was only given Nanashi's chocolate. Fine, then. In due time, I'd plan to take care of anyone associated with the Kage. So I'll just take care of you right... Student showing me up. I am not going to lose. This ends right here. Former heroes are nothing to me. But burying you will be the start of a new era. Sounds like he already thinks he's a god. Such an impatient god! Too slow! Here goes! Here goes! <laughs> 
never expected that he would be able to use Susano too. In other words, the glowing giant we saw in the forest. Yeah, it was him. <laughs> I needed to test out the artificial eyes and learn to control this power. Regrettably, I had to destroy a few forests during the testing. Either way, in the end, the entire ninja world will be on that. So I suppose it didn't matter. Not gonna let that happen! <laughs> Why would you try so desperately to save Yama? She's just a tool. Boruto is a man. You are truly disgraceful. You don't know how much she's suffered. I do know. But what of it? That was her fate. Our destinies are decided from the beginning. She was born a weapon. And her fate is to die as a weapon. I used her as effectively as possible. What more could a weapon ever ask for? You don't get to define her life! She's a human being! She's not a weapon! Very well. Let's say, hypothetically, she is. So what? It doesn't change anything. She's a human used by humans, and discarded in the end. Her fate doesn't change. How sad. Here the walls! They can be changed! I've seen plenty of people who have! What are they being made? The one you looked up to so much! That's why he couldn't become a god! You're the sad one. Bound by antiquated ways of thinking. You think someone like you could become a god? Don't make me laugh. <laughs> Powering me? I'm the god. 
god who will create a new age. It's impossible. I won't accept it. I will never allow you to defeat me. Yeah! 